tennis yeah. shoes. We, in tennis shoes. We yeah. wear dry suits. He wears blue jeans and tennis shoes. Yeah. Original Every style, right, John? For 20 years. Except for the treason. Right? For 20 years. I mean, I, we both been dancing with the silent. Hey, welcome to the, the very first annual North Branch Blast kayak race. John, Paul Dirty here, Queen Lines. Okay. <laughs> I can already see there's pin rocks straight down here. Yeah, there's line in between them. In attendance today, here's myself, Paul, Jason, Jimmy, and John. Are you ready? 20 seconds start now. Okay. Ten seconds remaining. Let's have fun. Let it rip. Okay. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Woo! Let's go!
my fastest time. Thanks. I got a few friends way back. But uh see you down there. <laughs>
Okay, this is crowded. Yeah, I haven't seen them, but they can't be too far behind, right? Yeah, uh, you want to attain and look for them? Super, super. 220, 350, 224. Oh, wow, okay. Yeah. Man, I just missed you. I was giving uh, another man a hand uh, carrying no, his canoe. No, 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 no. He had about an 80 pound canoe I was <laughs> helping up, you know. How about, how about an 80 pound kayak? <laughs> hey, same thing. All feels the same on the, yeah, the muscles. So 220, so. <laughs> One more foot. Oh, yeah. You'd be stuck in the rocks, you know? Oh, yeah. That's, that's, this, is, uh, this is Warnick up there. This is one. He, he followed good. He yeah. Was, there's a bunch of rocks. I just aimed to skim off my side. And, uh, yeah, he didn't mess up anywhere. Thanks, because uh, I'll tell you, uh, my outfitting with, um, Having the shorts on, I'm yeah. so much more looser. Yeah. So I yeah. couldn't use my hips at the start like I wanted to. That's that's set up for a, a dry suit yeah. and an underlayer. That's how I had it all the yeah. way up all the way up to this <laughs> week. Did it definitely let me know. Did you boat and find your line? Huh? Did you carve? <laughs> yeah, like I carved pretty. Boat. Yeah. The lunch stop, I actually carved enough to where I was fully on edge and I had to brace. I actually was almost over. I was like, whoa, didn't expect that. My hips were there was too much not enough space, too much space for my hips. But uh. So this guy, I can normally just plant my paddle and just yank the boat towards. Me? Yeah, water, right. Well, that's what happened to few. I couldn't get enough uh, yeah. purchase, and uh, I was a little loose. But I, I learned my lesson that you know the difference in outfitting between wearing the dry pants or just the pants and then these shorts. Like, definitely got to yeah. pad it more for Savage because there were some moves I made where I, even had it I wouldn't have been. I brought forgiven. the pads and just completely forgot because I knew I'd be loose in that thing. Yeah. Next next week I'm back in the dry suit. Man, it's 40, 42 <laughs> degrees up there and. Maybe air is 55. Oh, oh, yeah, man, way up north. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you'd be rewind back to, you know, in the winter, like in Minnesota. And, yeah. Uh, yeah. Definitely having having a tail to follow is, is helpful. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because I was oh. just in, you know, like beast mode the whole way. I was just like redlining it with my cardio. Just like, <laughs> so um, yeah. I was just pushing and pushing. But um, 
I much, yeah. Like last week, I, I let a friend down in Stony Creek Canyon the first time yeah, at the know. festival, and uh, like I, I, it's always an honor to be able to just be asked to do that just to give back. Because I remember when I first started, I was completely on my own and like 100. percent And um, so I feel so good to do that. I had a, I had a dry face. I, like I, I didn't even have like any splatter yeah. on my face. You That's know? the other thing. For years, I wear yeah. contact lenses. Uh -huh. And under certain circumstances, I go for the dry lines coming down from the falls, <laughs> yeah. and people are like, "Why well, you're making this up? There are no dry lines." <laughs> but um, well, I, I do. I have most of the time worked my way down. The biggest difference I noticed today at a thousand on the third wave <coughs> of top the world, I what didn't. I didn't get. I didn't, I didn't get launched that. into the moon. It was just all in the face. Okay. Or is that 1200? I literally got the air that I get on Scout at Stony Creek River. Like I was literally up, like going off in off rails in the sky. Oh, cool! But today it was just all like okay. boom, and we, so it, it really loaded the deck more than shredded it. So with you, I was interested. I was yeah. interested to hear that you just didn't even notice it because you just plowed over top, which is cool. I mean, because the unless, third, unless third John wave didn't is take where it's me, at. Unless John didn't take me through it. John, did you go through the the right line top of those three succinct waves? I mean, uh, succession. I mean, the big waves were smack up against the right. Right, that's what I went on. And right. So I, I had an angle slightly left to okay. the left, and we lost a little bit of time there, but it, it's almost hard to say because we're going up and down and smacking into those waves. That's what happened to me. Uh, yeah. yeah. Well, the thing was, instead of like the resurfacing like I figured I'd get, it was more like overloading the now, deck, you, you like on your Frankenstein. Actually, I find a lot of times just being slightly on the other side of the eddy line, um, and You've got your choice where to put the paddle, you know, to get the most purchase and drive yourself through. But, <coughs> oh, I don't know. No, John, oh. Whatever John did, he did it right, yeah. for sure. I've heard that a lot from people, too. So yeah. that's awesome yeah. for you, man. Yeah, whatever. Because I, I really had a walk in the park today. Wow. Just, just a stunning ride down. That's what I wanted yeah. to, man. That's why I was like really intent on getting here and just comfortable and cool because like, when you said a race, I was like, I really just want to do a lap. But yeah. then when you said a race, you know, my inner, my inner, like, okay, let's do it. Let's right? Get it right, yeah, man. But, but, inner competitor. Gonna, John, how much faster do you think you would have been if, say, if you were just going full tilt like racing, like trying to keep uh, up? I, I'd say roughly, you know, maybe two minutes easy. Um, okay. Yeah, if, if I'd been working I think out more like, like I normally five. do. Probably yeah, five. Been working John. out. Yeah, I'd say at least five. Because think of there's 6.2 miles. I mean, easily a minute per mile. I would think just if you were aggressive. Yeah. Yeah. With, if if you do this next year. Oh, that's that's the plan. I can even do it in September. To, try to find a. I was gonna say try to find a 1200 day. Oh, that's the that's the dream. Yeah. I I think with six inches more water, I would have just gone straight through that. You know. Yeah. I wouldn't. I wouldn't have even stopped. Was that was that at Warnick, like ha like before Robin's Nest? It was where yeah, you got hung before. up that one time. Warnick and it seemed like you were getting mad that you know we didn't stop to wait or something. <laughs> oh, my playboat would have 400. Yeah, that was funny there. Yeah, yeah. There's that's a tricky line. If you have to go right, you, right in the middle, diagonal left. Yeah. And hard you got to hit it hard. Yeah. And then you have yeah. to do another hard. And there's two rocks at the bottom of it that you had to kind of needle but through. But if you put yeah. your bow at the right spot, well, it lets it, you, you carve over so much easier. Okay. It just yeah. set low. Well, yeah, it's like four inches right there. Yeah. <laughs> so, so I, 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 as long as I had the speed, I could slide over stuff. Because this is, it's it's not rocks. It's rubble. Yeah. You know. Yes. So. Yes, the thing. You guys made it. Thank you. Man. You may rescue me, man. Oh man, what happened? Are you trying to take one of Robin's eggs and she got you? Oh man. <laughs> Just a beautiful day on the water, man. Absolutely. You said everything John did was right. Yeah, no, John John let me John takes the uh the solid lines, yeah. Yeah man. No, he, he did a spectacular job and um and we just cruised down. 